Hello, and thank you once again for joining us here at the Loveland Living Planet Aquarium. My name is Brent Beardsley, and we're going to be doing a fun science experiment that you can try at home. Now, we know that not everybody is able to get out and about right now, so we want to bring as much fun and excitement to you at home. And this is one that you'll be able to try on your own. Here at the aquarium, we have lots of animals and lots of fish, and that means we have lots of water as well. Most all of you have probably seen water at some point or another in your life, but have you ever stopped to really think about it? For example, if I were to ask you right now, is water sticky, what do you think? If you think water is sticky, raise your hand right now. If you think water is not sticky, go ahead and raise your hand. If you're not sure and you want to raise your hand to fit in, go ahead and raise your hand right now. All right, so we've asked a question, now we need to do an experiment. If we take a look at my finger right now, it does not have any water, but if I put it in the water, what do we see sticking to my finger? A drop of water. Water is actually extremely sticky, but we don't think about it because we're used to it evaporating off or just disappearing. But there's a couple really cool things that we can show because of how sticky water is. Now, to start off with, there's two words we need to talk about. One is adhesion and the other is cohesion. Those are just really big fancy ways of saying water loves to stick together with itself, its friends, cohesion, and it loves to stick and hold on to other things, adhesion. So we're going to start off, we've got a jar here. If I fill it with water and dump it sideways, what do you think is going to happen? Most of you probably said it's going to spill and fall out. So let's see what happens. You're right, it does. But if we put a lid on it and then turn it upside down, what do you think will happen? Yeah, you're right. It's going to stain because there's a lid. And as soon as I let go of the lid, what happens? It falls? Not quite. This lid is staying in place because of two things. One, the water is holding on to the lid because water is sticky. We also have air pressure helping push up trying to get in there, which holds it in place as well. I can even tap on it a little bit and it stays, but if I hit too hard, it starts to leak and falls out. So this is this fun, easy one you can do at home, have a floating lid and floating water there. Let's change it up a little bit. Here, we added a screen. Now, do you guys think that a screen holds water? Well, let's see, if we dump it right here, didn't hold that water, the water went right through. So if we turn it upside down and let go of the lid, what'll happen? Same thing as before. And if we take away the lid, what will happen? Same as before? Not quite. You can see that the water is actually being held up by the screen. Now it's happening because water is sticky and it's sticking and holding onto the wire, and it's sticking and holding onto itself to make a little layer, just like a lid. Now that lid is going to hold the water in place until we turn it. So these are a couple of fun experiments that you can try doing at home. So experiment around, see what water is sticky and what you can do with water as well. Be sure to join back in, we're doing bringing you all sorts of fun and exciting content here at the Loveland Living Planet Aquarium at 3 p.m. every day to bring the aquarium to you at home. Thanks for joining in and we'll see you next time.